what did you say? Hello, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome again to Iden Power City. Hello, everyone, and check this out. This is what I have been working on for a very, very long time, and it was really, really, really very complicated and very difficult project because of the shapes because of the designs as you can see try to make it big like i don't know like the egyptian beetles on on these marks in there as you can see if you know what i mean <laughs> i was trying to fiddle around here and there and trying to make some shapes and i was like why don't i make them look like beetles and stuff like this so this is what i end up with and i really really hope you do like it as well um this is a castle. I don't know what to call it, to be honest. I haven't got the name in my head yet. Yet um, I'm thinking of calling it um, a fancy castle, maybe, or an old Egyptian castle, or an Egyptian castle, something like that. Yeah, I'll probably call it like an Egyptian castle because of the beetle. I don't know, you know, these kind of stuff. And I love the gold and um, diamond blocks. And I was trying like to fiddle around with these towers and then I tried to connect the sides. Then I tried to build something in there. As you can see the flooring, the entrances, and there's a feature below me. And this is what I'm standing on. Check this out. A nice big water fountain in the middle. Huge one to fit with the castle towers. And it looks fantastic. And I was working so so freaking hard to separate the water exactly the same as you can see from the sides so uh, you all you have to do is just build the circles then try to build it all in fact and just put the water and when it leads to the first one try to break the blocks you need to water pass through then break the other ones the opposite way like made it in there you could see like the middle part is one below behind that one let me show you exactly like it goes one line in there this is like circle on the top and it goes two lines then separates to three lines then four lines and it looks cool i really hope you do like it you know these kind of stuff they really really take lots of time i mean the castle the beetles the idea of thinking about it it will be really really very kind of you if you hit the like button and i really appreciate every single like all of you guys boys and girls ladies and gentlemen left in my videos i really appreciate them so much and this is what keeps me going and going and going with building too many stuff you know for all of us to enjoy and have a good time and get some inspirations as well and as you can see the castle is huge and it's very fancy so i'll probably call it like fancy egyptian castle and if you have a different name leave it and i may think about it for something in the future so that will be fantastic as well and as you can see the middle part the way it looks like do you know what i mean it is really really very hard to do these kind of stuff but i just done it and i'm very pleased and i was taking my time so slowly to enjoy building it and this is the top of the castle check this out this is how big it is it is huge you know to be honest this is what i was trying to show you to tell you in my videos actually that i'm building big project and this is it you know it's so hard it's very nice and i really hope you do like it boys and girls ladies and gentlemen and i always always try to build you something you really like and i hope you do as well and you know these kind of stuff they really make the city looks fantastic it makes it look really really big and cool with these kind of stuff you know let me hide my hand check this out i love it I, and i really really hope you do as well okay let's go down um i don't know which side which now i believe the one there maybe and this is the entrances as you can see each one i'll be going through inside the castle as well let me go for the front of the castle um, there is like an old town in here old village town i call it or old town and this is my adam power city in there and check this out i got horses close by which is fantastic and i'm thinking to breed these horses now like and just spawn maybe a couple more the black ones honestly they were spawned by themselves 
and there is this rabbit in there and you can see there is another one black at the end there they look fantastic i love them i'm thinking to tie them with some leads you know to, to make them like nice for me close to the castle that will look fantastic <laughs> in the future if i build something that will look even much better let's grab them all i don't know if we can grab their rabbit as well i think we can um any defense i don't want them to be loose everywhere so i'm thinking of doing um yeah why not put it in there let's put them there yeah so don't wander in the wild this is your horses are you happy are you happy let me see what you will do are you happy yeah yeah you look like what did you do with these horses bring them to my house <laughs> anyway um I'm so freaking excited, you know, I just finished from the castle and this is why I'm I'm a little bit crazy in here, you know, I'm just so freaking happy about it. It is, as you can see, the flooring, I haven't finished even. I need to put probably like some flowers and stuff like this. I may do this stuff off camera. Um, I don't know, you know, I just, when I build something that big, I don't want to rush with it and I feel really, really happy to slow down myself and build it and take my time and just give it as much as I can of thinkings and you know these kind of stuff like I'm trying to make with normal windows then I decided to make them like you can see popping out to add some features some textures to them and I always always love to talk about these stuff so you get some inspirations yourself as well so whenever you're building something you think yeah, it looks empty in that corner or looks empty in that corner even these middle parts I was planning to make maybe like a circle windows but to be honest, I was thinking, nah, I just leave some pattern from the outside. It may look really, really nicer. As you can see, I left the upper level with some middle windows. I needed some light as well. And it adds some decorations. And it looks cool. Let me go around it all of it. And I'll go through in the middle of each of these towers. I'll try to pass all the way around. My God, this is so big and even my computer now is not taking it i think the city is getting too strong and i needed a new computer i'll be trying to save some com you know some money for that new child computer to be honest i needed a very very expensive one now because things is getting so so complicated with computers and every every single time they they produce a new game you needed much powerful computer you probably found you know found out about that yourself as well right let's let's go down um uh, is it pumpkins no i thought it's pumpkins let's go from from the main door probably for or well i have like eight doors all around the castle so two from each side and let's go inside okay check this out this is the towers and this is wherever you go inside in there and this is the middle fountain in the middle um, okay I have lifts inside the towers because I can't build the um, what do you call it stairs it's very high and if I build stairs it will take me another week probably because they very high towers and you just get in the lift and and you get to the second level you fly over the lifts and you have a good time in here and check this out I try to make these patterns even inside the tower just to add some feature as well so if you're standing in here i was thinking of like putting some ta tables and chairs and making it like restaurants and stuff like this but uh, it will take as i said too much time and i can't you know keep you waiting for more time to upload videos because i am when i work these big projects they take too much time so and i really really hope you do appreciate that time as well i'm trying to save for you as much as i can uh, to be honest this kind of stuff really really makes me happy whenever i build them in the, in the city and i will try if i have no more builds for now in the city i'll try to maybe next weekend to put it for download and i'll see if i finished as much as i can from the project i'm working on or because I'm, you know, I just barely started a new project and I'm thinking now just to save it for the next video after I put it for download. And as you can see, 
tower leads to tower all the way through and it goes again and this is the lift for the last level let me go to the last last level as you can I put it lift in there and <laughs> I hope you like my sound effects and check this out the chandelier in the middle you know these kind of stuff as I said I try to really really slow down myself and just take my time and enjoy building them bit by bit because you know when you build something in survival you have to rush with it because you, you don't have the, the stuff or all the resources and um, whenever you're building something big you need to go mine and collect and then come back and rebuild it and you have to make it bit by bit on video so this is takes too much time and the chandelier this is a huge chandelier as you can see and I'll try to make it fancy and I hope you like it okay let's go now from each tower to the other tower this is the corridors you know the one you saw the beetles the beetle is outside these towers like you could see in there like that one there uh, same window in there I'm standing now on as you can see so this is from the outside looks like beetle from the inside a simple window which is cool fantastic I really hope you do get some inspirations if you want to build some stuff like this of your own so just try to fill around two circles two squares then try to shave the sides or the edges and you know get something like a normal builder or I guess a normal constructor or I don't know what was the called person who dig in the stones and try to achieve something you know try to achieve a cool statue out of these stones um, you know these kind of stuff really really makes me happy whenever I build them I don't know I just love this map so so much this is why I'm putting too much time and effort of building and I keep thinking I want to always get a new ideas and new stuff built in this city and as I can you know as you you can see I did build before a big castle and this is another one but to be honest for me this is one of the best castles I ever built I already have a big royalty castle for who haven't seen it please check my first videos because it will be in there and it was a huge huge castle and I made it fancy like that and the other one took so so much time even worse than this one to be honest it was really really big and much fancier than this one but um, this one I try to use lots of small details inside as well so these kind of stuff takes too much time you know to add them as well you've probably done it yourself and you know how these kind of stuff takes time and as you can see I keep going from tower to the other so like three towers in a row which is fantastic okay let's go to the last tower and have one more look from the outside and I really really hope you do enjoyed every single detail in this castle I'm not trying to make these ones like lighting chandeliers or something sideways. <laughs> you know, these kind of stuff freaks me out when I finish them and I think, wow, I did this. <laughs> so I love it. And you could go out from here, come out to the middle of these castles, towers, castles, <laughs> what I'm talking about. And that waterfall, it needed to be in the middle because it was like a huge empty space and I needed to put something fancy and big so that's the only thing I could think about and it was fantastic and I really hope you do like it as well and I hope you do enjoy it whenever I release that map for download I really really hope you do enjoy these kind of stuff and let me show you something in here as well try to make it like roundish kind of you know I check the layout of these lines I try to make them all goes like you know what I mean try to make them somehow looks with too many details too many small touches and this is built as you can see behind the prison and that prison for who haven't seen it please check my videos you will enjoy as well that big prison in there and lots of villagers was kept in there well I don't know if I put them in the video but I know I put them after probably <laughs> but you will enjoy it hopefully you will um, okay hide my hand one more look and boys and girls I really hope you do like it You know, to be honest, I wish you boys and guys, ladies and gentlemen, can do build loads of stuff and let me see. So I get some inspiration myself as well. 
Elder will be fantastic. And it's not loading, I think, because I'm too high now. As I said, it is big. And my computer, I think, is a little bit getting tired of me building that city. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Okay. I think I put the distance a little bit further than I should be putting it just to show you as much as I can from that castle. So boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I really, really hope you do like this castle and please don't forget to leave a like, favor and sub, that will be great, big support and I thank you all very, very much for your support, stay tuned and I'll be seeing you soon in my next video. I don't power, out. <laughs> Goodbye for now, bye bye. <laughs>